All right, I'm looking at another deluxe waffle. This is the game like Wordle, but it's on a grid, and we have all the letters already, and we have to click and drag them around and swap the letters to make uh, words. And the green and the yellow works like normal Wordle. Um, the white is, you know, like the gray on normal Wordle. And uh, we've, we've got 25 swaps total, as you'll see right above me there, and we're trying to have five remaining at the end is the ideal uh, game. So. That's all we really need to know. Um, I'll put some letters on the screen over there that help you know what I'm thinking, but those are not actually on the screen. So, I mean, literal seems obvious across here. Uh, and we have two eyes, and one of them has to be in this first row. So that's all the eyes then, if that's literal. Got a few A's. What's this gonna be? Agility? Do we have a G that we can use? We do, we have one G. Oh, but it can't be agility. Is there only the one G? Yeah, there's only the one G and it's yellow, which means it needs to be in this column, so it can't G. Ability, ability, do we have a B? A B, there's a B. Uh, I think it's gonna be ability. I'm gonna move the B. Okay, good, because it, it was the only B that we had, so that's why I went ahead and moved it. All right, ability, there's several T's, so I'm not gonna do that yet. This is maybe I-N-G, what would that be? Getting, getting? Uh, E-T-N. Do we have an N? We do have an N, we do have an N. I was gonna say, this N has to be in this column, and this N has to be in this row, but we do have, oh, we have a couple of N's, a couple of white N's, so one of them can be in there, getting. This is probably I-N-G as well, with that yellow. A turning, maybe? Turning with the U? We've got a couple of U's. We've got a couple of N's, so we could do getting and turning. So literal, ability, getting, turning. Okay, we've got all those. Now, what do I want to do from there is the question. It seems like this bottom row maybe here, bottom row, we've got the N and the A that are definitely in the row. The E or the D could be, or those could be in the column, but... G, we could do something G-E-D, that's possible. The E and the D could both be in this row. Engaged, engaged. That would be really good, the N over here. This would be an E here then. This word would end in E, but it could be A, we do have a G here, A-G-E, something age. Um. A G E. What would be between the L and the A then? Can't be a T. Can't be an N. If it's not T and N, we don't have a lot of consonants we can use. Yeah, the problem is. Uh, oh well, we've got an F and an H. L F H E E. L, L, mm. Not F. Foliage, foliage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I A G E. Uh. Oh, but we can't do the I. If this is literal, we can't do the I. Because we only have two I's, and one of them needs to go in literal. Unless, unless this is lateral. You gotta think laterally. This could be lateral, which would use two A's. But, that would be all of the A's then. No, it wouldn't, we've got an A over here too. Yeah, so lateral foliage. Now, how many O's do we have? We only have the one O, don't we? I'm, I'm tempted to move the O. I'm gonna go for it. Good. I think it's gonna be foliage. I'm gonna move the F as well. Okay, it's gonna be foliage. Now, G's, how are we doing on G's? Do we only have the one G? We do. So I'm gonna move that. Okay, very nice. All right, uh, and we only have the one D, which I am more confident is over here now. And plus, we wanna put an E there. So let's go ahead and do that. Awesome. And now we have two eyes. Uh, one of them goes up here. 
Um, what is this gonna be? I'm not sure. We've got the I. It feels like there's gonna be E D here, just like there is here. This is engaged, right? Yeah, engaged. Do we? We've got a few A's. We've got a few N's. Okay. Engaged. It feels like Y something D. It's got to be an E. We're putting an E in getting. Uh, we're putting an E in engaged. So that's two of the available E's. The other E would go here. How many do we have? We've got four. So we've got another E still. Uh, L, A. We've got an A. So something laid. Um, relayed? Relayed? Depending on how you want to say it. Relayed, which would be T something R, T... T what? Because I think we've used all our E's now, haven't we? Getting has one, engaged has one, relayed has two, that's four E's. We've got four E's available, so we can't use an E up here. So if it's T something R, can't be T-E-R or T-I-R. Hmm. Can't be T-A-R. U. We do have another U, don't we? T-U-R? Fight. F-I-G-H-T. Fight. Fighter. But that's another E. Gutting. Not getting. Gutting. 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 Not getting. That lets us do relayed and fighter. Okay. Okay, there you go. So, now we gotta get the things in the right places. <laughs> um, these two both need to be A's. Uh, this needs to be an E. This one needs to be an N. Okay, so this needs to be a U. This needs to be an A. This needs to be an N. So we can do all three of those. Good, good. And now we need A here, I there, E here. Okay, both the I's, both the I's need to be E's, right? So, right, this is an I, this is an A, this is a... No, this is an I, this is an A. Okay, we only have one H, so let's go ahead and move the H. Okay, there we go. Now, N needs to go down here. T... Do we only have the one U? Yeah, we only have the one U. So let's go ahead and move the U up there. Okay. <sighs> We're getting there. Um, this needs to be an E, an A, and an N. So there we go. Let's do that. Good, good, good. Now... Uh, we only have one R, so let's move the R. These three can swap around. This needs to be engaged, so we'll swap those. There we go. Now, I, E, A, T. Yeah, okay. So T down here, E up there, I and A swap. This... Only T left goes there, the only I goes there, and we swap these two, and we end with five swaps remaining. Oh, man, that was a little bit tricky. Okay. Oh, frabgious day. Glorious, that was magnificent. All right, so there's the definitions for the words fighter, lateral, ability, engaged, foliage, gutting, turning, and relayed. All right, very nice. So, a little bit tricky today. Um, with the GHT and... Yeah, and then I had literal instead of lateral, and getting instead of gutting, and there was quite a few possibilities there, and foliage is a tricky word, so. All right, tough one this week. Let me know how this one went for you, uh, how many swaps you had remaining at the end, and which word you thought was the hardest to get. And of course, be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you again soon with some more puzzles. Now, here comes the fun part. The patient was then instructed to plug their nose and blow Kind of like eight, which is 19 minus 11. Yeah, 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 that'll work. So seven times three. Okay, well, lucky guess, I guess. 
and we need an L or an E still. So we have an I, we need an L or an E, we need an O or a T, we need an O or an R. Well, that was really bad. Really, really bad. So the only words that use the W or the L are the words that start with the W and the L. So, oh, poo. Like Winnie the Pooh. 